Hi everybody, I'm Amy and welcome back to my kitchen at Little Spoon Farm. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make the most tender and moist sourdough zucchini bread. It is so easy to make and it uses really simple ingredients. So if you have some sourdough discard and extra zucchini, then I highly recommend that you try this recipe out. So let's go ahead and get started. Grate the zucchini using the large holes of a cheese grater into a colander and squeeze it to help release any extra moisture. Set the colander aside and allow the zucchini to continue to drain while you mix the rest of the ingredients. To a small bowl, add two cups of all-purpose flour, two teaspoons of baking powder, one half teaspoon of baking soda, one teaspoon of salt, two teaspoons of ground cinnamon, and one half cup of chopped walnuts. Whisk these together and set aside. Now we'll mix the wet ingredients. In a large bowl, add one cup of light brown sugar, two large eggs, one half cup of sourdough starter discard, two teaspoons of vanilla extract, and one half cup of vegetable oil. Mix until smooth. Add the dry ingredients to the wet ingredients and stir until combined. Give the zucchini one last squeeze and stir it into the batter. Pour the batter into a greased nine by five inch baking dish and bake at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 45 to 55 minutes or until a toothpick inserted into the center comes out clean. Let the zucchini bread cool for 15 minutes Run a butter knife around the edges to release them from the dish and then transfer the bread to a cooling rack. Enjoy your zucchini bread warm or at room temperature. You guys, I know that you're gonna love this sourdough zucchini bread as much as we do. You can find a list of the ingredients and the full recipe instructions on our website at littlespoonfarm.com. So until next time, bye. Mm-hmm.